know is that there is a housing crisis that is huge and instead of the state government using this as an opportunity to actually um, provide more public and social housing what are they doing they're flogging off land right here 600 Elizabeth Street an amazing site that could be more public housing for the community and instead they have got the most outrageous spin and are calling it build to sell in anyone else's language that is privatization we need more public housing lots of discussions we have and we all get a bit confused we in the movement as well confuse the terms social affordable community housing we need more public housing we're still here. and the best thing that we can do and i thank you all on behalf of a very grateful movement that sometimes gets a bit tired is to turn up when good people like you turn up Ordinary policy makers and quite frankly disappointing politicians notice. Trust me, today you will be noticed. Thank you. They have to build it. It's not their money after all, it is ours. So spend it on us. What our, what our uh, New South Wales State Government seems to have forgotten is that the word public, especially in public housing, was never be, meant to be profit driven, which is indicated in the press release last year that stayed in part to optimise social housing on the site at no cost to the government. The people that are in government weren't born when I uh, was born into public housing. I know how the system works. I know it can be successful, but successive governments have ruined public housing for the people. They, they've let it run into the ground and they've got no idea how to manage it. Shame. Our government is more interested in warfare than in welfare. Shame. And that's how it links in with this. Okay, the time to put profit in the housing market over the right for people to have a home is over and done. We need to take the profit out of housing. That is the only solution to solving the housing crisis. But the state government has only one interest, and that interest is clear. That interest is to hand over blocks of public land, hand over and privatise and sell off public housing so that their developer mates can make more money. They say that the housing crisis needs to be addressed right now and we demand no sell off of public housing. Not now, not ever, no excuses anymore. Redfern is the site of many battles around housing. The Aboriginal housing um, was fought for and won with the help of the Green Bands, Black Bands in the 70s. And there's massive, massive public housing estates around here. And so we want to say to the state governments, the federal governments, enough is enough. We have a housing crisis. And so we're fighting to win here. What do we want? Public housing. When do we want it?